Hey, it's Whitney again from Butch Talk. I just saw a drag show last night. So I've seen other types of drag shows like with drag queens before. Where I used to live in San Francisco, they're probably a little bit more prevalent with the drag queens. And then also here in Minneapolis, I've seen more shows advertised for drag queens. For the past few years, I'd say maybe for the past like two and a half years, I've, I've been curious to just go to a show and see what the whole drag king scene is like and i didn't end up making it to any of the shows in the bay area there was one that i was aware of that happened in oakland and then maybe one in san francisco that was just starting or something but i didn't end up making any of those shows and so i was interested in checking it out here in minneapolis luckily within the first few months of being here there was a show. Last night I went to Dykes Do Drag. Basically how they describe it is Dykes Do Drag are queers of all genders and orientations that anyone could fall for, celebrating an, and expanding continuum of gender expression and performance. This performance art cabaret is the longest running show of its kind featuring traditional drag, burlesque, live music, boylesque, modern dance, video and visual art, and lip syncing and enticing and exciting hilarity. So I went and it ended up being a really cool show. It was really fun and it was parts of it were really funny and parts of it were more serious and parts of it got audience participation going on and things like that so it was just a fun night. It was fun to be in community with other people and um and yeah just be a part of that. Ever since I started like looking up different like drag kings and I would say that would probably have been about two years ago that I started doing that and just kind of looking to see what was out there who's doing what I was like oh I wonder if I could pull off something like that and I haven't actually done it yet but Sorry about that. I was not really expecting, uh, so here's the thing. I know Jay Beeves, kind of. We're mutual friends. I've seen him out and about. He seems like a fairly decent guy, although kind of pushy. Likes to just be the center of attention. Sorry about that. Hijacking my channel for a second there. Yeah, I don't know if he's gonna be coming around often, or maybe just every once in a while. I'll have to talk to him and see if I can get a hold of him. All right, if you have any comments or questions or things of that nature, please put them in the comment section below. I love reading what y'all have to say and enjoy engaging in conversation with y'all. If you want to subscribe, click over here and you can see more videos. Maybe JB's will pop up. Who knows? See you, YouTube.